Yes. You, uh, I should say earlier, you spoke about Algeria and France mm -hmm. and how you uh, thought that French France was definitely wrong, imperialistic, but you weren't going to support Algeria because it would be another nation against you. Right. You spoke about the evils of South Africa and its apartheid and how you wouldn't or how all the other nations had cut ties, they didn't. So as a leader of an Israeli government, you would certainly be in league with them. In the 1930s, Adolf Hitler used hatred as a tactic to pull his people together after the shattered, war-torn years of the First World War and got his country to work motivated by hatred towards and an extermination policy towards your very race. He did what he had to do. Just like what you say, you do what you have to do to keep your country alive. And what I'm trying to say is it's that same kind of political amorality that has led us to the wars, to Hitler's, to Stalin, to the Khmer Rouge, and yes, maybe even you. I just thought you should think about it. I was really afraid that after that asinine comment, people would really clap. However, I'm going to answer you. Do you think that the Jews of Germany threatened Germany? Do you think that the Jews of Germany were running around Germany saying, it's really our country, and the Germans took it from us, and when we have power, we're going to take it back and call it Israel? You think that that's what the Jews said? If they had said that, then Hitler would have had every right to deport them, not exterminate them. They didn't say that. The Jews of Germany wanted nothing more than to be the best Germans that ever lived. That's the difference between the Jews of, of Germany and the Arabs of Israel. They don't want to be Israelis. They don't want to be Jews. They claim that Israel is an illegal state. It's a, it's a settler state. It's an imperialist state. And they want to wipe, to wipe it out. That's the difference. I don't want to exterminate the Arabs. I just want to move them out. And believe me, if I was the prime minister for one month, they'd be out. Yes.